Hey everyone, it's Living Dead Gal, and welcome back to another episode of the 100 Baby Challenge. I don't know about you all, but I've had a very long, very stressful day, and I decided that the best way to unwind was to play this challenge and deal with infants, and soon we're also going to have newborns. Apparently this is how I deal with my stress, by creating stress in The Sims game, so I hope you guys are excited for what I think is probably going to be a chaotic episode, because Rain here has currently has two babies and she is pregnant with two more which gives us a total of four babies so we are about to have babies three and four today any minute now actually because she is currently in her third trimester she was in her third trimester for a pretty good bit of time in the last episode so for right now she is just practicing sitting with little Lori here so we're just gonna kind of dive right in. I did just wanna say, I feel so dumb, guys. Uh, a lot of you commented. So the reason that I was shocked that we could tell which of the kiddos was a vampire and which wasn't was because when I used to play, oh, there she goes, first pass out of the episode already. When I used to play this challenge um, on console, I know this is gonna sound shocking. I didn't go in and edit the babies in cast. I don't know why I never did that. I only ever edited like the matriarchs. I think just on PlayStation, I don't know. I was like really more about like playing than I was about create a sim. I would still do create a sim like when I would first make a sim, but I never really went in and edited that often. Crazy, I know, um, until I got my PC. And when I got my PC, which, okay, she's now having an emotional meltdown because she does have that emotion bomb. I never actually had any occult babies since I've had my PC and custom content and all that. So I didn't know until just, you know, the last episode that you would actually see in cast if they were occult sims or not. So that is why. So I know I sounded really dumb, but that's why, because I've, I have I haven't really played with occult babies in a long time, not since I used to play on console. And when I did that, I just never edited them in cast because I, I don't know, it was, I was a crazy person then, who knows? But anyway, let's go ahead and dive in. It is currently Saturday in game. On Tuesday, the kiddos are gonna age into toddlers. So I'd like to have them age up earlier than that if possible. Oh, Rain, hun, I know, I know, I know you've got the emotion bump. <laughs> She's so sad. She's having an emotional meltdown. That's from her little fame quirk that she got in the last episode. So I'm just gonna let her hopefully sleep that off. I don't know when she'll go into labor. Okay, so if growing together is installed, the infants only need to have tried three of the mashed baby foods and one finger food, but they have to get the crawling and pincer grasp milestones. So neither one of them can crawl yet, but little Michael is, let's see, he is working on learning to creep and he is working on learning to grab. And little Lori, she is working on putting toe in mouth and rolling over to her tummy. Okay, so she still hasn't rolled over to tummy yet. So we actually do need to try to do some tummy time with her, but I really need to let Rain get a little bit of shut eye. We do need to make some money because I did, we have like $600. I did spend some, I just put a crib in the little newborn baby room. I really want to decorate a nice nursery, but we just don't have a lot of money. And I got a couple more lights and things um, just cause it was kind of, it was like a little bit dim in here. So I wanted a little bit more bright lights cause I like my game to be blindingly, blindingly bright. I mean, that's just how I am with my computer in general. Oh, and she has gone into labor. Okay, we are starting off with a bang. My poor girl can't even get a good night's sleep. She's really hungry, but she's going into labor. So let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and have these kids. We are gonna have the baby at the hospital. We are gonna join her. Uh, we do not need a man to come with us. Let's go, girly. Let's check in. I wanna go have this baby, these two babies. So it is gonna be two baby girls from the ultrasound we saw last time. Yes, we're skipping the line because we are about to give birth, but we should meet this little handsome fellow here. I like the looks of him. Okay, here we go, go time. I am gonna try, once we kind of get through the first batch of kiddos, now that I know that there's a trick to make the realistic birth, you can do it without having to like go through the really long, intense labor. Um, I think I might try a couple of other birth options with her. Like maybe we'll do like a C-section one, a natural birth, maybe, maybe even a home birth. Now that I know that we can like, 
do it quickly without having to spend hours of her like in labor trying to like get fully dilated. I think that might be kind of fun just to mix it up. But I think for the first batch of kiddos, we'll just do it uh, the normal way, even though that's very dangerous clearly because they keep taking out my girl's heart. Land grab over here. I don't trust you. I think I need Simon. I feel bad. Simon should be delivering his babies. This is gonna be babies number three and number four. I'm super pumped for this. We're gonna have two little baby girls. Let me pull up the comments from the last episode. So, so many of you have left amazing name suggestions. I'm gonna go back and make like a running list. But for now, I am actually going to use some name suggestions by Ashley Exofel because I think that this is perfect. The baby girl twin names are Alexa and Alexi. They are the Grady twins from The Shining. So I think that's perfect to kind of fit with the horror theme. Um, fun fact, The Shining, while hailed as a very great horror movie, is not one of my favorites, but I really do appreciate it for what it's done with the genre. So I really like the idea of doing Alexa and Alexi as the names for the girls. So we're gonna do Alexa and don't mind uh, the X button just makes my reshade turn off. Oops. So Alexa and Alexi, where are they? Uh, where are they? Okay, there we go. <laughs> there the babies are. Yay! Oh, they have dark hair like rain. Oh, I'm excited. The doctors prepared the birth certificate. More to add to our little baby certificate wall. I am excited. Oh, look at Mama Rain with her baby. Oh. <laughs> She freaking loves her kids. She is like starting to get a little bit tired and a little bit drained, I think, but she does love her kiddos. Yes, okay, and the babies are where they should be, which is perfect. Just wanna make sure that she can reach them where I placed them, so let me just make sure. Look at the cute little babies. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, Lori got the rollover to tummy milestone. She has gained the ability, oh my gosh, and Michael got the grab milestone. Oh my, all on their own. Look at these little independent kiddos. So she's getting the ability to roll over onto her tummy so she can do tummy time on her own. And Michael got the um, grab milestone. So he's close to getting the pincer grasp. So, okay, let's see. Rain is just watching Lori do tummy time, but she's about to go hold the baby. Nope. Ah, okay, yeah, the crib isn't gonna work. I'm gonna have to change out the crib. Darn it. I was really hoping it would work. It's because it has a footprint on it. Okay, hang on. I'll be back. A few moments later. Okay, I had to switch out their crib. Um, This was actually the old one that I originally had, I think, in the game. I liked the other one for them, but it just, I need to go in and remove the footprint. But this one should work, I think. So let me have her... Oh, she can kiss her forehead. Okay, I want her to put them in some little outfits. Let's see. Um, they let me think. The Shining Twins, they wear little blue uh dresses, right? So let's try this uh frozen bunny one. I want her to put them both in the little frozen bunny onesies. Actually, you know what? I think Michael can actually um sit up. So let's go ahead and help him try his first baby food. Let's do pumpkin puree. Obviously, pumpkin for Michael Myers, right? Like that makes the most sense. So we're gonna try some pumpkin puree for Michael. So look guys, look at our little shining twins, Alexa and Alexi. Look how cute. <laughs> if only I could give them like, I think that it's like a little pink, uh, pink ribbon on them. I can't remember, but they do have brown hair. So we have Alexi and Alexa. And we're trying Michael's first baby food, pumpkin puree. Oh, I do need to get pictures of them actually. Oh, he liked pumpkin puree. First food milestone unlocked. Oh, Rain's happy. She is super happy now from new baby and my pride and joy from watching a milestone. Oh, we've got little babies crying. Oh no, okay, little Alexa is crying. I just want Rain to have like a few minutes to herself though. So let me have her go ahead and take a shower and do a little bit of shaving because she's gonna wanna have Marcus come over. Okay, she's gonna look at, take care of the baby first. Okay, the baby's picture changed, but that's fine. These are Simon's babies. So I'm actually surprised they didn't come out with blonde hair. Um, I guess that could change. I think with this baby skin like default replacement, they can have blonde hair as little babies, newborns. So I'm not sure. Oh my goodness, sit up milestone and look. <gasps> look, look at little Bean, look at baby Lori. She sat up all by herself. That is amazing. Okay, both of my baby's profile pictures have just completely swapped out. 
That is so weird. They were different pictures a minute ago. Rain is just trying to do some beauty stuff because she's going to invite Marcus over because we are going to try to get pregnant with the next kiddo. Let's go ahead and help Lori try her first baby food and we will have Lori also try pumpkin puree because that's just fitting. You know, they're my little Halloween babies. So far, so good over here. We do need to do some cleaning up. We've got dust bunnies everywhere. So I need to try to get my dust bunnies to be a little bit happier. We at least have 200 simoleons to our name for right now. But there we go. We've got the, the new twins birth certificates. Look at that, guys. Four little new boos. All right, Lori, let's see if she likes the pumpkin puree. Oh no, who's crying now? Alexa's crying again. Alexi hasn't needed anything, but Alexa's crying again. She liked pumpkin puree. First food milestone unlocked for Lori. She's so cute. I've got a lot of stuff I want to try to do today, guys. I want to get Rain pregnant again. I want to make some money. I want to get our dust bunnies to actually be helpful to us. I want to get these kiddos ready to age into toddlers. And I want to, um, what else do I want to do? I want to take pictures of them because I want to try to get pictures at every life stage. And Michael unlocked the Babel milestone. That's super cute. Oh, look, she's excited. She loves her babies. She's so cute. Oh, see, look how happy she is. I love her. <laughs> and look at little baby Lori. Okay, that's the wrong one, hun. That's the wrong one. Leave Alexa alone. Go to Alexi. Alexi's the one who needs help, hun. Well, you know what? Let's help her explore another food while she's here. Let's let her try some ice cream and then we'll let her out. Oh, Caleb is here. Oh, he's here to hang out with his kiddos. I love Caleb. He's like kind of becoming our best friend. I know like <laughs> in the past episodes, I'm like, Caleb, why are you still calling? But I'm actually, I've like grown to love it and stuff and just reading your guys' comments about Caleb and kind of how he's been in all of your saves. So I definitely, I kind of want to give Caleb a CC makeover, which I've already actually made over Caleb. It was one of the first videos I ever did on my channel, but I kind of want to do like an alpha makeover for him in the style that he has designed in this particular save file, just like so he'll be kind of different because I feel like he's Rain's like best friend and he's a vampire, so he's probably going to be around for a really long time. So, oh, OK, I don't know why these two just glitch with all their hugs and everything, but that was cute that they at least tried to hug. It just it failed, but they're like kind of best friends. He he does need to be become our best friend. What did she think of the ice cream? She loved it. OK, so she's tried two of the three baby foods. Oh, Caleb's cleaning up our house for us. Thank you, Caleb. That's his vampire speed is coming super in handy. Since Caleb's here, I won't invite Marcus over yet. I'm trying to get her like keep her pregnant, but I am also realizing that I'm going to have a full house very, very quickly. And once I get a full house, she will start aging. So I might just give her like a day like to just kind of focus on the kiddos and trying to make money. And then we'll try to get pregnant again, maybe tomorrow. She still has, if I look at her, she still has 27 days before she ages up. So we've been doing pretty good with her. All right, kids, I got to put you all to work. Do some more tummy time. Look at the babies. <laughs> I love this. Uh, he's like, Rain, you've got to keep your house cleaner. Oh, look at them. Look at the little best friends. <laughs> She's probably like, can't you just help me have 100 babies? And he's like, Rain, I totally would. But the challenge rules say that I can't. So sorry, you know, our, our that ship has sailed. But you keep doing tummy time, kids. Keep doing the tummy time and playing with the toys. We got to get these milestones. I should look for another frog and then we can start breeding frogs. So I might send her out to do some like digging for crystals and frogs. Creep milestone unlocked for Lori. Yes. OK, that's one step closer to crawling. OK, Alexa and Alexi, my little shining twins being pretty good over here. They're so cute. I love the little sleepy like baby face update is really precious. Oh, look at Caleb hanging out with his kiddos. Like, oh my gosh. I see now I'm already like getting a storyline involved. And the whole point of this was for me to not do a story base because everything I like to do is story based. And this is just supposed to be a challenge. And now I'm coming up with all these story ideas for Rain and Caleb in the future. But no, 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 don't do it. Don't do it, Storm. Leave it be. It's a hundred baby challenge. Just hundred baby challenge. That is a cool painting, Rain. She's only at a three on painting. She's at a six with parenting, which is good. Photography is pretty low. I want to try to get her photography up. And I do want to take pictures of the little kiddos. Oh, no, we got another screaming, crying baby. OK, Caleb is heading home. Thank you, Caleb. That was super helpful of you to come clean up all the little diapers and trash and stuff for me. I really appreciate that. Let's put the kiddos to bed and then we can finally take a nap. 
Oh, which one's crying now? Is it Lori? I like can't tell which one's crying because they all just have like, they're all crying all the time. But oh, okay, there she goes. She's falling asleep. All right, let the kiddos cry it out. Let them cry it out and go to sleep. They're so cute. Yeah, I wanna have like a really cute little family photo wall for them. Um, oh, Rain didn't even make it to her bed. She passed out on the floor. I'm trying to get her a good nap in. Okay, hon, you go ahead and bunk down. I'll probably take like a couple of my own like posed photos and put some CC photos up. But when I can afford it, I wanna get the Ravachin like camera mod tripod so that I can like take some photos of like all the kids freely with poses. But for now, what I'll probably do is before they all age up at each life stage, I'll get a picture of them like before we have their birthdays and stuff. Oh, poor Rain. Okay, they're both crying, hon. You can't get to sleep. Okay, how long do we have until the babies become infant? infants tomorrow so we have one day until they become infants we're gonna end up with four infants if i don't get moving on the infant stuff but i really need to get rain's needs up and take care of her you go ahead and get some sleep hun after you take care of the kiddos oh my gosh she's at parenting level seven already she is so good at this she is killing it she just, I like go here and have her do just baby care stuff and then she'll just sit and rock her babies for like 20 minutes. And I'm like, Rain, go get some sleep while you can. Cause as soon as she's done, she's about to go to bed and then another one has a dirty diaper is hungry. But she just like wants to spend her time with the babies. No, she sees she's about to pass out again. I, can, I can't get her to bed. Every time I try to get her to her bed, she passes out. So yeah, maybe this will become like the toddler room and we'll keep this as the infant room. And then the new booze will maybe have to go in Rain's bedroom for now. That might be what we'll have to do because she can't seem to make it far. She can't get to her bed before the kiddos are crying and screaming again. Now, I think what I can do is uh, with the rewards points, with the rules, it did say that you can um, use stuff from the reward store as long as it doesn't do anything to like prolong their life or save their life. So I could get her like sleep replacement stuff and get her like some of the stuff where she's never sleepy um, if we start to like get more and more stuff you know, from her rewards, like for her wants and needs and whatever, what is it called? Um, wants and fears now? Yeah, I can't remember. I always, I'm never gonna like not think of it as whims anymore. Okay, she has a sentiment with Caleb, growing closer from quality time, first sim ever kiss and first woohoo partner. Oh, we got another crying baby. I'm gonna let mom sleep for just a little bit longer. Slept through the night milestone. Oh, both Michael and Lori got the slept through the night milestone. That is cute. That is so cute. Okay, babies are really, really crying now. All the babies are crying. All right, Rain, have you got a full bar? Not quite, but you gotta get up. We gotta take care of the kiddos. Oh my goodness, there's so much crying right now. Toe and mouth milestone unlocked. Lori is sad though, cause she's awake and sad. I'm so sorry, but she unlocked her toe and mouth. Okay, we're gonna do tummy time while we're here. Michael is sad, needs help, and he's hungry. Okay, Rain, we're gonna have to help Michael out in just a second. Ugh, I can't believe someone pranked my toilet. Oh my God, the crying. The crying is so bad. And we'll have Michael try smashed lemon. Oh my goodness, babies are crying yet again. Oh no, see, pranked toilet. Okay, well we don't have time for that. We gotta feed little Michael and then we gotta change the dirty diaper of this child. But Michael desperately needs food. Talk like a pirate, it was awful. I'm so sorry it was awful for you. Okay, but Michael is gonna have some smashed lemon. Let's see if he likes the smashed lemon. He's so cute. <laughs> I love him. I love his little facial expressions. I freaking love infants. He disliked Smash Lemon. Oh, he hates it. He's like, I hated the Smash Lemon. Don't ever give that to me again. It's like three in the morning and all the kiddos are up and screaming and crying. Okay, let's try our third food for Michael. Let's let Michael try ice cream too. And we'll have Lori try sweet potato puree. Okay, he loved ice cream. So Michael and Lori both love ice cream, we have learned, which is awesome. <laughs> Lori is just chilling in her crib. I love that she can sit up now. Okay, so he has now officially tried three of the, oh no. Oh no, now he's a mess. You're gonna have to bathe him. <laughs> he's so cute though. It's Alexa's birthday and it's Alexi's birthday. Oh my gosh, guys. We're gonna have four infants if I don't hurry up. She was unsure about sweet potato puree. Michael has tried smash lemon, pumpkin puree, and ice cream. So he's tried his three baby foods. I think this is the third one that Lori has tried. 
Come on, you're supposed to eat your food. Okay, she's, she, I told her she could eat the scrambled eggs and bacon, but she went and did the, she's helping the kiddo out first. She's so good. She always puts the kiddos first. Ah, oh, I need to fix my CC because I hate when they wear clothes in the bath. I really hate it so much. I need to go in and like, I need like a whole weekend to just completely fix my CC folder. Okay, it's 5.30. Once it's like a reasonable time, I will invite Marcus over and we will get Rain pregnant again. I love you kids, you're real cute, but we've got work to do, okay? We've got work to do, I've got you guys, I need you guys to get your milestones, okay? All right, I'm gonna practice crawling with them because I need them to get crawling and pincer grasp milestones. I cannot believe how much these kiddos have blown through their milestones. Like in my Growing Together series, I worked so hard and I focused on one infant and I swear like the later milestones, I had such a hard time getting them. But these two just get them without me doing anything. It's crazy. It is crazy. I don't know. Caleb just brought me good luck babies, I guess. She's like, come on, see if you can make it to the hallway. Lori's like, I don't know about this. I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I've been an infant for not very long and you're, you're putting a lot of pressure on me here. Come on, Lori. She's like, no, I give up. She has given up. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. <laughs> she just did. She, it looks like she passed out, but I think she just gave up. <laughs> These kiddos are definitely a lot of work. And then we're gonna have to vacuum some of this stuff and clean a lot of this up. Oh my gosh, I gotta fix this toilet. I cannot believe someone like pranked our toilet. I wonder who it was that did that. Was it Caleb? I don't feel like Caleb would prank our toilet. It was probably Simon. Oh my goodness. These kiddos, every two seconds, they need something. The newborns are rough. It is their birthday, so I could age them up today, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait a little bit. I wanna get her pregnant first and make some money. Yeah, ideally I would like to be able to age up the two kiddos at the same time as the babies. The kiddos are close. So I just gotta work on a few more milestones with them. I do need to get some money though because I'm gonna need money for toddler stuff. Cause I'm gonna wanna keep these infant beds and I'm probably gonna wanna just keep the crib. First blowout milestone unlocked, oh no. Oh my gosh, it's taking her so long to fix this toilet. I have it fast forwarding and I just hear kiddos like crying and it's just, it's awful. Oh my gosh, there's just so much stuff everywhere. Oh no, first blowout. She is a mess. Oh, it's a nice, beautiful day. I wanna like have her put the babies in the back carrier and like go for a jog and stuff, but my girl just doesn't have time. Oh my, what? That was freaking scary. I did not like that. I did not like that at all. Well, I asked her to change her on the changing table, but okay, whatever. I'm trying so hard to like get the house clean and it's just like pile after pile of like dirty diaper. Oh my God, this house is just wrecked. Poor Rain, just trying to keep the house clean, trying to take care of the kiddos. She's never gonna get sleep, is she? Okay, we're feeding the dust bunnies. We gotta take care of our dust bunnies. Those are the only pets that we can have. Why can you not get to this one? Sim sessions. I don't know who you are. You're a really cute Sim, but no thanks. I don't have time for the Sim sessions. It would be a great place to meet guys, but I do have a guy lined up. I just, I'm trying to get the house clean so that I can have him come over here. I don't know why she can't get to that one dust bunny. It's like facing the wall and she just can't get to it. <laughs> Lori gets red hair in the bath and puts on a bear onesie. So yeah, we have great little bath time looks for the kiddos. So Marcus, um, invite him to come over. He's gonna be like, um, why are there so many kids and why is your house so dusty? Okay, here is Marcus, he is here. Okay, amazing, let's invite him in right now. We gotta make sure we invite him in because last time I couldn't woohoo with him because he wasn't invited in. And now let's try for pregnancy, right to it. We don't have any time to waste, Marcus. Um, it's time, we didn't get to woohoo you in episode one like we wanted to. You're tense, you came over, you're tense, you need to blow off some steam. I need a baby, this is perfect, let's do this thing. Let's get to baby making and let's do this thing, let's make it happen. Hoping for numbers, at least number five, hopefully number five and six from Marcus, but we will see, we will see how it goes. No protection was used, beautiful guys, well done. Take a pregnancy test, hun. She is not pregnant, okay. We need to try again, but she's about to pass out. So we're gonna have to try one more time after she passes out on the floor here because this is just what we do in this series is we just pass out on the floor. That is where Rain spends the majority of her time is just face down on the floor. Messiness kills the mood <laughs> from attempting romance in dirty surroundings. Oh no, I hope he doesn't leave. Oh, he's cleaning up for us. 
Okay, thank you, Marcus. He's still 10, so we, we gotta go again. Come on, I feel like they're gonna make me do this three times because they're just gonna make me keep spending money on a pregnancy test when I'm like really poor. <laughs> okay, hun, go take a pregnancy test. Come on. I know, I know you're stinky. I know, just go take a pregnancy test. We just gotta get pregnant again because I we've already like aged one day. I don't want you to age another one. Oh, she is pregnant. She is pregnant. Okay, okay. That was so weird. It like glitched. It like didn't have the option to take it. And then <laughs> it came up. That was such a weird delay, but okay, she's pregnant. Yay. I'm gonna have to age them up soon because it's about six o'clock. I really wanted to try to get, I did not want to have four infants at once, but I don't know if I can get the other two kiddos ready because Rain is real tired. Yeah, she's about to pass out. Okay, let's, once you wake up, take a photo with Marcus, please. Oh, Marcus is cleaning our toilet for us. Okay, you know what? The baby daddies can help with the cleaning at least, at the very least. Cute. Oh, okay. Let's see what other poses we can get. Oh my gosh. Okay. Why do I love that one though? What they're so, they would make, they're like actually like a really stunning couple too. Oh, I can't wait to see what their babies look like. <laughs> Why do I love these pictures of them like being goofy together? <gasps> I love that picture. That is such a good picture. Look at all these photos. Okay, that one. That is the winner right there. I freaking love that photo. Let's put the rest in her inventory for now. I wonder if I can have her put like one of the babies in the back carrier and go search for frogs. We should do that because that would be cool. But okay, she's got to take care of the newbie. She's reached parenting level eight. That is insane. Thank you so much, Marcus, for like cleaning up for us. I really appreciate it. Don't worry, guys. I will fix up the wall next time I go into build and buy. Um, but let's go ahead and do, let's add a frame. Let's add some light wood. Beautiful. Oh my gosh, there's so many bottles everywhere. Oh, and we've passed out again. Oh my goodness, these babies are so needy. Oh my gosh. Just crying and crying everywhere. Okay, time to feed Lori. Caleb, come help, come help. I know, I know that he's not allowed to help. I know, I just like having him here. It makes me feel better. Oh my God, we have so many hungry kids and she's like, oh, <laughs> this poor woman's boobs. The absolute disaster. All the babies are crying except Lori. All right, Lori, hun, you just do, you can, you can do some tummy time, okay? This is just the whole episode has been like just the sound of babies crying like in my ears right now. Oh my God, these two don't stop crying like ever. Shut up! All I hear right now is just babies crying. <laughs> I haven't been able to like make any money at all. Look at Caleb encouraging Michael. Oh, and Rain's about to pass out once again. I feel like I need to just get her a sleep replacement potion. Um, let me see if I can get that. Cause it's not, it is allowed in the rules. Her spotlight is fading. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. I got to do something. She has 880 reward points. I'm going to get her a sleep replacement potion because my girl really needs it right now. Cause we need to make some money too. Um, because I need more infant beds. Oh my God. They're all fussing and crying. What's wrong with Michael? Oh, be there, the babies being nearby are making him cry. Rain, you put him down in the worst spot possible. Oh, he's practicing standing with him. <gasps> that was so cute. Oh, and they just got the adoring sentiment. Oh my gosh. Caleb, I love you. He's getting this easy makeover. He's getting one. It's happening. He's he's the best baby daddy. Meanwhile, Simon has not been around at all to see his kids. Him and Rain are still on kind of bad terms though. So, okay, we're going to practice crawling with Michael and we're going to give Lori a bath. This is gonna be cute. And look, Caleb's here to watch her practice crawling with him. Why is this so freaking cute? <laughs> this is like, I didn't intend to have Caleb be like the first baby daddy. Like I didn't set out to think like, oh, I'm gonna have like, you know, a vampire baby daddy at first, but I'm really happy that Caleb was the, just walking down the street that day. All right, Michael, let's do this, buddy. Come on, buddy. Oh, he's like, no, this sucks. I don't like this. I don't wanna crawl. I think he's about to give up. <gasps> Wait, wait, he did it. He just did it. He just crawled to her. Oh my God. Is he gonna get it? He definitely just did it. Is he getting the milestone? Is he getting the crawl? Look, Caleb came over here to watch it. He's getting the crawl milestone. 
<gasps> he did it, guys. He did it. Crawl milestone unlocked. Okay, are you gonna crawl? Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Okay, he's got a really upset look on his face. Caleb's like, I should get going now. He just came here to see his son learn to crawl, but he looks so sad. But like, oh my goodness, I'm so happy. He got the crawl, so now he just needs the pincer grasp milestone, and then he will be good. Okay, so we need to practice crawling with her. He's really, really tired though. Oh, he's gonna have a fit soon. Okay, come take care of these two little new boos. Oh, okay. Oh, I think they just aged up. I think, oh no, I missed it. Oops. They're about to age up. <laughs> I ran out of the timer, guys, but it's okay. It's fine. I'm kind of done with them being new boo. So Alexa aged up. Let's see what she gets. She is a sunny baby. Yes. Okay, sunny babies are chill. Oh, okay. She is blonde and Alexi aged up. She is sensitive, which means they're prone to diaper rash or often picky with food and can more easily become overstimulated. However, they rest more peacefully through the night when soothed. Okay. Well, that's exciting. Okay. We have red hair. I don't think that makes sense. I think I'm going to change her hair to be black hair. And then we've got, okay, so we have Alexa with blonde and we have Alexi with red. I'm going to change it to be black like green so that we'll have one blonde and one black. Like since Simon had blonde hair and Rain had black hair. <gasps> oh no, Michael, did you have a blowout? Oh no. Okay, Rain, we need to give a bubble bath to Michael. Oh, this is tough. No, she's itching in her pubic area. I can't afford, oh no. Oh my gosh. We have two weeks until our property taxes are due. 1,410, our celebrity level has been lost and we at least got rid of our behavioral quirk. So hey, I'll take that. We've got $483 in bills that we have to pay. Child support received. Okay, no, no, child support's not allowed. I need to figure out how to turn that off in the SMB bills app. But oh my gosh, okay, I need to do some math because I need to reset that. We can't have the child support. So let's see, 9,000. What do we have? We have 10,000. Oh man, if we could have child support, this would become so easy. I could have the most beautiful little baby rooms, but we're not gonna play it that way. We're gonna follow the rules. Okay, so I need to put our funds back to 308. Okay, let's set that to 308 simoleons. Okay, I really do wanna take care of these little kiddos, but first I kinda of need to get, oh my gosh, guys, four infants. What am I even gonna do right now? Oh, I can't believe we're itching in the pubic area. Okay, I'm gonna have to get her to the wonderful store. Are we taking Michael with us? <laughs> She's just taking him with her to the wonderful store. <laughs> this is gonna like take all of our money. I need to get her painting like ASAP. So we're gonna have to get the lay shampoo. It's $200. I feel like it's realistic that that would happen given, you know, how many babies the woman's trying for. So I think that we'll keep that on as much of a pain as it's going to be. And it's going to make it really challenging for me. I think that's okay. But let's use the shampoo. Okay. Use the medicine. No more itching. Okay, great. Oh, frequently hiccups. I didn't know that was a quirk you could get. Alexa seems to hiccup quite frequently. Infants with the frequently hiccups quirk have more gas in their tummies and hiccup more frequently. Oh, okay. I really need her to come spend time with these two babies. Pull to stand milestone unlocked. <gasps> Michael, he did the pull to stand and I totally missed it. <gasps> she's getting it. She's getting it. She's getting it. She's getting it, guys. Oh my gosh. Yay. Okay, she is about to get the crawl milestone. So all we need then is pincer grasp and for them to try finger foods. Okay, she got the crawling. Look at her go. Look at her go. Okay, hun, are you gonna crawl? Or are you gonna do weird scooting? Okay, good, we're crawling. Yes, okay, amazing. Amazing. Oh, she looks like Simon. Oh, hates being held. Alexi hates being held. Oh no. Oh no. And I'm sorry, I don't mean to be neglecting these two. I just, I, I do want to get in cast with them. It's just, I really, really, really want to get everybody like in a good place. <laughs> I'm hoping she'll grab the spoon soon. I really want her to get this pincer grasp. Come on, girly. 
I can't believe I got them to crawl. <gasps> she's grabbing, she's grabbing, she's grabbing, she's grabbing. Pentagrass milestone unlocked. Oh my gosh. Okay, now we just have to explore finger food with her. And then Lori is good to age up, guys. Go ahead and give her a finger food. Let's give her peanut butter puffs, okay? Oh my goodness, Alexi got the reach milestone. Look, she already got the reach milestone on her own. And Lori liked the peanut butter puffs. Okay guys, Lori is ready to age up. And let's see, when is her birthday? We're ready to age her up a whole day early actually. So that is really, really good. Which is good, except that I don't have any toddler things and Rain has no money. We're really gonna try to get this pincer grass for him because I wanna kind of keep the twins together as much as I can. I know I might not always be able to do that, but I'd like to try. Oh gosh, I have to pay bills too, okay. I really need to have her make some money like really soon. If he doesn't get it this time, I'll let Rain take a break and eat. Come on, Michael. This is all riding on you, bud. I need you and Lori to age up together. I don't want to keep you separate. Oh, <gasps> look, he knows. He knew it. He did it. He did it. Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay. He loved homemade hummus and he unlocked the pincer grasp milestone. Oh my god, I'm so proud of him. Okay, let's give him some ODOs. Let's see if he likes ODOs. And then poor Rain can get herself something to eat. And then she is gonna have to bake a cake. Yay, we're gonna get to age him up a day early. We're doing so good. Oh, Rain, you should be way more happy, hon. She's like, I have no money. I have $93 and I'm pregnant again. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, it's not like quite the angle I wanted. I wish that I could get like a better angle. <laughs> It's because she's taller. It's cute though. Oh man, I really wish I could like tilt it more. But that's okay. That is okay. So cute. I'm just gonna take all of them because you know, you know how it goes. She doesn't look particularly happy, but look at her little socks. She's so cute. Oh my goodness, that's too precious. Look at the little socks. Look at Mama Rain with her baby. Poor Lori is like passed out. She's like ready to age up. Okay, I really need to get this show on the road though to age them up. So Rain, once you take care of her, look at little Michael. He just fell asleep in his high chair. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh no, she's a feeding tinkler. Okay, I'm like learning new quirks and stuff. Alexa often pees while being fed. Infants with the feeding tinkler quirk are more likely to use their diaper during feedings. Oh no. We gotta get a photo at each life. He looks so mad. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh no, he's mad. <laughs> we do have to get photos at every single life stage though. Oh, I'm gonna like miss them being little infants. I don't feel like they were infants for that long, but you know, we, we gotta keep moving. I can't, I can't like wait. The house is a mess. We don't have a lot of money, but let's age these kiddos up. This is like the worst spot. I'll have to, I can't wait till I can like afford a nice little kitchen island for her so I can like take photos with the walls up and everything. We gotta get some pictures of this moment. The first baby of the 100 baby challenge to be a toddler is Michael. So let's see how he ages up and what crazy CC they put on him. Oh, Caleb has sent Michael a gift. Oh no, he's got some crazy CC on him, I can tell. So he got the inquisitive trait. Curious explorers, these toddlers gain thinking skills slightly faster. And he has the independent trait. They love their freedom, that's amazing. And he's got a bonus trait, okay. They do need to age up with the top-notch infant trait or the happy infant. He got the happy infant, which is really good. Although not perfect, he was quite a happy infant. He will tend to build positive relationships with Sims around him. Oh, and he wants to get his read first book milestone, okay. He, the kid looks, he looks crazy. This skin detail, I may just have to take it out of my game. They keep aging up with it, but okay, there we go. Little Michael, uh, he's got blonde hair. We will fix that for him. I never thought we would have this in The Sims. I know that it's been a while since we had this update and like everyone's excited for horses now, but I'm sorry, I'm still in awe of this. I'm still in awe of this update because I really didn't think we would see the day that we would have little babies crawling around. Oh, did he just pass out on the floor? Oh my goodness, my poor child. I need to make money for them so they can get like a bed and stuff. This is bad. Maybe I need to have her go explore because then they'll go to daycare. Oh my gosh, wait, I missed it, I missed it. Oh my gosh, I'm talking and I like missed it. I need to get a picture. Okay, that was cute though. But we were getting our little birthday photo with Lori, okay. 
Lori is aging up, so this will be the second toddler of our 100 baby challenge. Let's see what crazy CC and she has something in the mail, a gift from Caleb. She got the clingy trait. Okay, these shy toddlers avoid Sims outside the household and get sad if left behind. Okay, and she got the silly trait. Goofy and curious, they love to tell jokes and get playful. Okay, and they'll earn imagination slightly faster. And she did get a bonus trait. She also got the happy infant, although not perfect. Okay, so we didn't get the top notch, but we did get happy, which is pretty good. I will take it. We needed that. Um, and then I got to figure out what we're going to do about money. <laughs> Because we have 73 simoleons. I don't have toddler beds. I don't have toddler potties. I don't know what we're gonna do. Oh no. Oh no. Michael and his sister are not getting along. Oh no. Everyone's upset. Oh no. I'm so sorry. Okay, this is truly just the picture of chaos right here. I really, really, really want to get into cast with these kiddos. I really want to figure out the money situation, but I have been recording for a really long time. I wanted to try to like have like an ultrasound in each episode and like have a cast makeover in each episode, but it has, I've been recording for quite a while at this point. Look at the scene here. Look, it's chaos. So I really do want to get in create a sim with all of the babies and give them really cute looks, but I, it's going to take me a really long time to do. So I'm going to do that at the beginning of the next episode. We'll give everyone their makeovers. We'll go to the ultrasound and we are going to have to hustle to try to make some money. It's about to get tough. It's been pretty smooth sailing so far, but it's about to get really, really tough. Um, so I've got to prepare myself, especially because she's pregnant again. So this is going to be a lot when we have a full household, but I'm also really excited for it. I just need to kind of get grinding on the money train here. I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Um, again, I'm sorry I didn't get to do all their makeovers and more in this episode, but I do I do need to put myself to bed at this point. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please just do hit that thumbs up button down below. Please do leave your baby predictions. Predict, uh, let me know how many you think she's having. Let me know if you think boy or girl or both and leave baby name suggestions as always. And if you did enjoy this episode, please do hit that thumbs up button down below. Thank Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. Bye. Bye.